much. My name is Fans. This is your Katie of Boss Boys. Thank you guys for this cool Pokemon Pixel Art video. It's so awesome for you guys to be here. Today's Pokemon that I've got for you guys is of Diglett. Before I explain about him, let me explain about myself. It's my name is Peter Alvich. Despite my blindness to my Pixel Art, square by square, pixel by pixel, as you guys can see in the time lapse in front of you. Um, I do all of this in the state of Minnesota. So if you guys want to learn more about me, my artist statement and social media links are in the description below. So let's get right into the character. So today's Pokemon is of Diglett, like I said. And, um... Diglett is a rather interest. I mean, if you can read the uh, in information in the description, but personally to me, he reminds me of a, you know, kind of like a ground mole kind of guy mixed with a pig. I mean, <laughs> it's it's a really interesting thing, but basically he's a, he's a dirt. Uh, underground uh, type Pokemon, you cause earthquakes and all this different stuff. Um, what you guys are seeing in the picture is a numerous different things. To start out with is that his character design is pretty much the same. However, his color variations and everything else is alternately different. What is surrounding him is rocks on the bottom. That's just generally how he is shown on the games as well as the TV shows, you know, because he always pops out of the earth. Um, as to the uh, colors and variations, I wanted to do something kind of different with this Pokemon, uh, just because I wanted to try something different, and I thought, you know, well, with doing variations on each different Pokemon, why not try something new on this guy? And um, because he's very simple, and I wanted to make more detail out of him. You know, he had a lot of, he had a lot of. Um, very smooth and very just, you know, one color type areas. I wanted to do multicolor with some swirls, with some purples and pinks and yellows and browns and all this really cool stuff. And, you know, I wanted to make sure, make it look like he had a shine on his head, you know, like he normally does. So you see that bright yellow spot at the top of his head. And, um, oops, excuse me. So my, and, you know, his eyes are kind of blue you know just just a little bit just very hint is to know that they're blue but uh originally they are black uh and i think i think this really turned out cool i i tried a new variation i really like how this turned out i might do this future um future Pokemon that need a little bit more of an oomph in detail just because I'm one of those people that loves to use the open areas and open spaces and add detail to them um i can't remember if I explain this, but if I didn't, <laughs> uh, here you go, is that these pieces are 150 pixels by 150 pixels. That's this, what size this one is, or squares, depending on how you perceive it. Uh, my pieces off of YouTube are 2 to 4 million pieces, uh, 2 to 4 million pixels. So if you guys want to learn more about me, my artist statement, social media links are in the description below. Um... But otherwise, I hope you guys enjoyed the time lapse. I hope you guys enjoyed the Pokemon. You know, give me your feedback. If you like, favorite it, and share it. Uh, subscribe if you're not subscribed. There's more any content coming out. I just don't want you to miss it. Otherwise, uh, remember that Perseverance is your key to the impossible. And I will see you guys in future Pokemon Pixel Art videos. As well as the rest of Saturday's uploads. So thank you guys, and see you later.